The first step in the bucking process is to determine the bind that exists in the log you're about to buck. On this log that we're going to buck in this, we look at the log and it's supported on this end and it's supported out here on this end and it's suspended in the middle, which tells us that the wood on the top is pushing together in compression and the wood on the bottom is pulling apart under tension. So we need to know that as we cut into the log, the kerf is one going to close behind our saw. After we've determined where we're going to buck, take into consideration your bind on this process. We'll initiate our cut from this position, standing back, looking over the bar, with our bar 90 degrees to the log. And we can see it from this position, but it's hard to see starting bucking at this position, the position of your bar. So we'll start to cut here. After we cut in, we'll move across, we'll pivot our saw up, and cut off the far side of the log. The reason we do that is after we come back and we start cutting down through the log, when we want to finish, we don't have our power head underneath the log. We're only using the amount of bar that we will need to finish our cut. We'll be able to move back away from the log as we make our release cut. Before we start any cut, we're going to clear our work area, make sure we don't have any tripping hazards, so as we make our release cut, we step away from the log, any log movement we can move away from. We also want to determine to make sure that there's nobody along either side or close to the log that might be affected by our cut when the log moves. If you're on a steep hillside, you're going to want to make sure that the hillside below the bucking area is clear of people because you may kick a piece loose and you have no control once they start to roll down the hill. As you can see, we only had the end of our bar committed just enough to allow us to finish the release cut and step back out of the way. In our wedge, we turned our top bind, our wedge kept us from pinching up. <laughs> 